Birdman, you guys, I'm not sure if you guys are too familiar with him, but he's definitely a freak. Uh, he's really good. Once he gets an opportunity, you guys will really know his name. What do you think about getting a shot there? I mean, I mean, do you think that's a position you might try to cross train out? Oh, uh, yeah. I actually uh, threw the idea out a couple of times, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> What about, what about the new guys? I mean, have you been able to stay in touch with them, uh, Pickens and those guys? You know, yeah, I talk with uh, like KJ all the time. Man, I'm, we're, we're pretty cool. We talk all the time uh, on a daily basis. Uh, I haven't got a chance to talk with Pickens or uh, the other guys. Man, um, like, play lot, Tom. Yeah, Tom. Yeah, I haven't got a chance to talk with them too much. But I mean, uh, as soon as they get in, I mean, I'll take them under my wing. You know, push them to be the best and let them go out there and compete, make plays. What was it like for you to yeah, you know, have some younger guys under your wing and you know, kind of being that lead leader and stepping up for the team this season? Uh, I mean, it's been it's been a joy. Uh, just knowing that people depend on me and then like people looking up to me, it's, it's actually a fun experience. Uh, honestly, uh, I mean, I know I can't mess up, so I got to push myself uh, two times harder, so it makes me better while I'm making other people better. So. You said you threw the idea about you playing slot out there. I mean, what are some other guys, but some of the guys that probably work on the outside you think would be good fits in there and, and dealing with that guy? Uh, we got a lot of fluid guys that could go in and play in the slot. Uh, I mean, Matt, uh, he's real tall, but he's he's really fluid. So, I mean, I could definitely see him maybe in some packages uh, yeah, going in and playing uh, in the slot, just creating some havoc, as you, you guys heard. That's Coach Martin's word. Uh, so, yeah, I definitely can see that happening. Is D is D Rob a guy? That play oh yeah, there? definitely. D Rob can play in the slide as well. I'm sorry, I left his name out. Uh, is that yeah. he, he's an interesting state. You know, obviously he came highly touted from Cal, and he put up the numbers he did out there. And last year he wasn't able to get a catch. But uh, what what have you seen from him so far? Uh, he's definitely he's he's been developing uh, great. I mean, uh, this off season he's been working. Uh, seeing him out there, I can see that he's definitely bought into the system and everything, and he's, he's really uh, ready for this upcoming season. We got a chance to talk to him after the Sugar Bowl, or I guess that's a championship game, and despite not being productive, as productive as he wanted to be, he still had a really good attitude about it and everything. I mean, do you see kind of a, a different guy than maybe you saw last year during preseason camp? I mean, you know, has he made some strides in that regard? All right, definitely, he's made some strides. Uh, it was about him. Uh, I mean, he learned the offense better and things like that. He's uh, more capable of going out there and just, like, uh, being dependable. So, that, I mean, that's, that's really what it is. Uh, he's been doing pretty good at that. You made that step yourself from your freshman to your sophomore year and kind of learned about How big of a deal is that for those that don't know? I mean, how big of a deal is it for you to get comfortable and confident in routes and the offense? Oh, it's a huge deal. I mean, that's just going to be able to motivate you and take you over to, to the next level and be able to compete on the field and stuff like that. With the coaches see that you're, you know, you're, you're confident in what you're doing and you're comfortable and you have an understanding of what's going on on the field, that's really going to uh, give you the token to be able to go out there and compete. JJ, was it kind of shocking to you, the, all the transition, because y'all kept – Wide receivers and tight ends went from being a really experienced group to one that's now it's going to you, Charlie, and Tyler. To, have, have there been any growing pains so far? Uh, no, has not. Has drastic change? Not there? so far. The thing is, like, we, we rep things so many times in practice, so it's just like next man up mentality. So it's not really like any growing pains or anything like that. Uh, I mean, we're pushing the guys next to us. They just haven't been able to compete as much, uh, as, much as us in, like, actual games. But uh, they got all the practice reps and everything like that. And, I mean, going against our defense is just as well as going against any other team. JJ, what kind of attention did you get from defenses as last year went on? And how do you think it's going to change now that, that you're probably the number one dude, uh, you know, at least uh, that's in the league now? Uh, I honestly couldn't tell you what, whatever they're, they're scheming to do. Uh, I'm just going to do my part on, on my end and make things happen. How is your... You mentioned Kiaris, uh, right, how he's got that locked down. We've kind of been hearing that. I mean, Coach Smart even mentioned him last year. He was a guy that... If he doesn't pull his hamstring, I think, early in camp last year. What What is it that Kiaris brings to the position? Uh, I mean, he's, uh, he's, he's, he's pretty bulky and stuff like that. Uh, he's, he's a physical guy. He's uh, fluid, like I was saying earlier. He's fluid. He's a good route runner. Uh, he's, he's like a uh, just a, a stronger version of, like, Miko or something like that in that slot. So, I mean, Even stronger, you think so? Yeah, he's a little bit bigger? Yeah, he's bigger than Miko, so, yeah. What about Matt Landers, Tommy Bush? How they come along? Oh, they're coming along great. Uh, they both been making big time plays. Uh, encourage them uh, to keep uh, getting into the playbook and learning more and more, and so they could be able to come out there and, and help us on the other end.